Guys, and welcome once again to Godzilla Daikaiju Battle Royale. And what the heck? Okay, I thought the music was fun to Fritz for a second there. Anyways, we're going to be playing uh, Anguirus this time because we can. Anguirus 1968 switches from standing to a crawling position. This changes his basic attacks. And, uh, yeah. In the year 2XXX, we've already seen all this. Antarctica. Alrighty. Anguirus basically appeared in 1955 in Godzilla Raids again. He was the first enemy Godzilla ever fought, and uh, he is a jerk. Okay, no, I mean, Megalon's a jerk. You're awesome, Anguirus. He, okay, he can swipe at you nuts. That's great, we got a Labrador Retriever from hell in here. Get back here, you. Get back under my fridge where you belong now. now. Don't put your mouth there, that's very unhygienic. And it is also... Oh, cool. Now that is... Yeah, every time a monster doesn't really have any long-range energy attacks, they usually have some sort of charge attack. That's the case here. And yours can close the distance pretty rapidly by using that uh, pink cushion blaster attack, whatever the heck you call that. And... Knock it off. Oh, okay. Apparently he uses his tail as a third kick attack. Unlike a lot of it... Unlike a lot of fighting games, the kick here is a lot faster than the punch, but it also doesn't do as much damage. Cut it out. And down he goes. Next, Monster Island. I hope there's no monsters on there. Alright, the game will begin in 3, 2, 1. Ooh. Well, he's got some pretty awesome. Well, on the one hand, we're facing uh, Entree Red Lobster. On the other hand, he's doing quite a bit of the damage to us, but on the other hand, that's a pretty neat music they got here, really. I appreciate it. And this guy is Ebera, a giant sea monster shrimp thing, who first appeared in Godzilla vs. the Sea Monster sometime in the mid-60s. He's actually pretty he's actually pretty badass in close-up combat in this game, but other than that, he's got nothing. Okay, scratch that. Go away. People like me more than you, anyway. Next up, Tokyo. Who's in Tokyo? Drei, zwei, eins. Wunderbar, it's Worga again. Unfortunately, he uses gigantic hands, and we are built of spikes. Gee, I wonder who was gonna... Ow! Knock it off. Unfortunately, he can also block with those humongous hands, so maybe it's not so easy after all. Arf, 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 to you, too. Ow! Cut it out. Go away, go away. No, wait, come back here. Come back here, I'm a close-up fighter. You can shoot a giant death yellow laser. I need to come close to you. Okay. Okay, so we fight with... Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be attacking like this anymore. Okay, so... What's the charge attack when... Okay, when we start on four fours, the charge attack is... Alright, that wasn't so bad. I'm off all fours. The charge attack is just a charge attack, not that pink cushion blast thing. You're stronger and more clever than we anticipated. And hey, wait, don't cut me off, you Jim! Okay, we'll begin in four, three, two, one. Ah, oh, crap. You beat me once, never again. This is Mecha Godzilla. He first appeared in. First of the Godzilla vs. Mecha Godzilla back in 1974. He is. He is dangerous, man. Seriously, this dude will kick your ass if you're not... Okay, cut it out! He's got quite a lot of attacks, and really my only hope is to close the distance with this guy and start wailing on him before he can shoot any of the 8 trillion death rays and missiles and lasers and God knows what else he's got up his sleeve. He, won, he actually fought a year as film, but he also killed... I may be in trouble here. Nah, man, not so bad. Yeah, can roar too. Rah! And snort too, for that matter, if you... Oops. I didn't mean to... Yeah, that wasn't so bad. Next! So you managed to defeat our base guardian. No matter. We are now taking you to Planet X to prevent any further... Oh, you jerk, I told you not to do that again! Game will begin in... Eventually. Oh no. It doesn't begin. That's the final boss. Oh crap. This is Space Godzilla. In this game, this dude is. Ow. 
dangerous. Seriously. He's got a lot of dangerous attacks. He's fast, he's dangerous, and he's got a... Yeah, that's pretty much all he needs. He's got only one real weakness, and that's the fact that he's, his basic punch and kick attacks aren't too powerful, and uh, the more crystals you destroy, the less stuff he can do. But on the other hand, can he regenerate the crystals? I'm not sure. Yeah, cut it out. But don't say He's zapping me without even touching me! What a snot. Ow! Yeah, I got pointy stuff too. Only I don't throw my pointy stuff away. Cut it out. And come on, come on, baby, come on. Don't launch anything huge. Please don't, please don't. I might actually win this. Oh, please, oh, please. Crap! So close. We'll try that again. You're not pulling that crap on me again. Oh, no, you don't. Okay, come on, come on. I can back you in the corner all day. Whether I can keep you in the corner is a different matter. Okay. Wow, I'm actually kicking his ass for some reason. Punch, kick, punch, kick. This is getting a little repetitive. Let's say we jazz it up just a notch. With, okay, with a meteor shower. Okay, whatever. That's a bad place. Don't bite there. You don't know where that's been. You don't want to know where it's been. It's been across the universe. It could have been a million places. Oh, this is so very, very wrong. Yeah, well, I'm winning this time at least. Oh, and I can jump into this attack too. You like that? How you like that, you jerk? Come down here. Yay! We win. Paradex could not defeat the monster as we saw. The world was saved thanks to Anguirus. That's a bit like saying the world is saved thanks to Robin. Anyways, thanks for watching. We're gonna catch this up next time, and ooh, we locked for unlock for Ron. We're gonna pick this up next time with Mothra. I'll see you then. Have a good night.